So a few years ago, I created this guy using some concrete and a plastic skull that I got from the Dollar Tree. In that same video, I also created this guy who, <laughs> this hurt out so well. but I knew I didn't want to throw him away. So all that time I was wondering, what can I do with this guy to try to save him? Which brings us to today's video, because I think I have an idea. I remember watching the Marvel Zombies on the Disney Plus What If series, where they zombified one of my favorite superheroes, Captain America. And it got me thinking, why not try that design on this skull? Now, ultimately, all we have to do is just make the cow. And I could easily just paint that on there, but I already did that for the Joker skull using mostly spray paint and acrylics, and I want to take it up a notch. So let me walk you guys through, as well as myself, the madness behind my thought process. I have some of these foam sheets that I got from the Dollar Tree, maybe Hobby Lobby. I can't remember. They're everywhere now. Anyway, I thought it'd be really cool to use these to make the cowl for the skull. And then like we did with the Joker, spray paint in some of the other details. Now it is a nice day outside. Blue skies, smiling at but it's me. hot and I don't feel like going out there. <laughs> Plus I have enough brain damage, so I will not be painting inside this time. Instead, we're just gonna use acrylics on this. So now that we have the game plan, let's get started. <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. I had to walk away from this project. It was frustrating me, and right now to me, it just looks a mess. I was not expecting an ugly face doing this project. To me, this is horrendous. But as they always say, you just gotta trust the process. I've come this far, I'm gonna finish it. I think I can save it.
just say that I'm very happy that I didn't give up and I kept going on this because this is starting to look really, really cool. Yes, the chin strap comes out and you can tuck it in on the other side like so. But now I get to move on to my favorite part, which you may or may not know is painting. <laughs> done let me just say i'm so happy i did not give up on this project because this turned out amazing look at that how cool is that this thing is super cool just want to spin it around and show you guys all the work and detail that i put in on this and yes this little chin strap can actually tuck in on the side here completing the captain america cow and his entire look I was this close to scrapping this video, but I'm so glad I didn't listen to that negative voice in my head and push through, because he turned out much better than I ever could have expected. This thing is actually pretty heavy, so if a real zombie came in, you could definitely knock him out with this. I do have some other video ideas using these skulls for Halloween, so if you're interested in seeing those videos, be sure to subscribe, because how would you know if they're uploaded if you're not subscribed? And if you would, go down to the comment section, let me know what you guys thought about this new Marvel zombie, Captain America. Oh, and don't forget to check out that original video before you go. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I'll see you next week.